we have declared ourselves to be secular we want that notion of uh, you know religion based treatment to go away but then you create policies and you know schemes based on religion it will only deepen the sense of you know religious identity from a consumption of public goods perspective so for example uh, you know we have this uh, the first point that we are talking about here right there was this uh, sachar committee report and as a result of that various schemes were um, created uh, targeting uh, minority uh, communities one of them says that uh, wherever there are uh, con- you know minority concentrated districts i think it's called mcds you know particular region they have some geographical specifications for that if the percentage of minorities is greater than 25 or something then there are special schemes which which includes you know things like uh, spe- uh, you know, focus on creating roads street lights uh, easy access to loans in that area and so on so multiple issues with this first of all if you create schemes targeting you know concentrated areas people are going to concentrate more i mean it's easy access to resources there right and secondly it deepens i mean the money something like a road or a street light or 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 a bank loan is a public good there is no religious identity or a religious tag in that each of us based on needs and you know whatever other non religious criteria should be equally uh, you know qualified to apply for that and get it but this is specifically targeting that so it can only deepen the sense of a uh, communal identity in the country if we go this route i think that's the bigger problem with this uh, uh, this approach uh, 